Punyalah lama kita tak berjumpa dekat YouTube channel Hari ni kita dekat MIEC Langkawi Untuk Lima Dulu kan aku masuk gate tu Masa Iron Man Memang boleh Satu minit Okay boleh Sama cerita So aku dulu masa Iron Man aku masuk gate ni Untuk tukar Aku punya transition from bike to run Tapi hari ni aku datang MIEC untuk lima So jom kita tengok kapal terbang Dekat sini Macam-macam ada babe Let's go So ni dia First time aku nak tengok Bro aku tak pernah datang lima bro Padahal kalau korang nak tahu aku memang passionate gila about, about aviation ni Yeah Aku dah excited siut kau tengok tu Aku tak tahu sekarang aku nak pergi mana dulu Aku nak pergi mana dulu ni Adakah kita pergi tengok Jet Fighters kat sana Ataupun kita pergi tengok Aku tak tahu nak pergi mana dulu ni Nak pergi mana lah Sana dulu lah Ok jom Bila dia dah macam redup sikit Baru kita pergi tengok kat sana bro Aku boleh nampak Typhoon Jet Fighter Ada apa tu Bro 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 Bapa aku lah Syed Agung Look at that bro The robot giving salute Sekarang ni kita tengah tunggu Entourage Agung That's Agung right there Dia bawa kereta apa ni? Macam BMEV kan? Eh? I7 I7? Nice Wow man Aku suka dulu ni military staff bro Kau tengok ni yang akan keluar tadi kau tengok All in uniforms man kita punya positioning kita memang ye ya. <laughs> Ni memang kekecohan lima guys. So it's Langkawi International Maritime and Aerospace Convention. Every year lima ni ada and everything is here. Everybody is here. Jom kita masuk dalam tengok. This style, bro. This is freaking Iron Man stuff, bro. Kita only. What is this? Edge electronic warfare. This is a proper drone helicopter, bro. bro. Look at this. It's an unmanned helicopter, bro. Technically, it's a drone. Kita only, bro. Garmusha. Aku nak try, tapi aku macam takut, bro. Nak pegang. Aku takut nak pegang bro. Aku nak pegang tapi aku takut. Bro. Specification dia. Berapa kel bro? I have no idea how to read this. 51 5.1 kg. Aku tahu kalau aku main uh, Call of Duty aim R1 ni bro. Nampak apa ni? Berat tak berat dah bro. It's not heavy at all. Ah. This is the machine bro. Kalau kau tengok ni mesin yang kita tengok dekat selalu dekat TikTok kan dia orang buat macam uh, binatang anjing tu ni dia. Dia tengah tidur je sekarang ni. Tapi kalau dia menyawa dia macam yang kita tengok kat luar tu dia macam anjing. Color desert storm pula tu. Ini kalau kau tengok yang macam film Interstellar tu kan Part yang masa drone tu, masa first scene dia datang landing kan Drone ni siap ada launcher man Dia punya design prototype lah It's not the real thing Tapi ni dia punya all the cameras untuk detect Where the missile is going to go Now this is this is cool Aku rasa kalau budak-budak drone dapat tengok yang ni Ni boleh carry anak orang bro ni Carbon fiber parts Kau rasa ni dah besar kan? Kau tengok ni Ni dia drop satu bro <laughs> Aku tak tahu nak cakap apa, man. Aku tak tahu nak cakap apa, bro. Bombs apa, bro? Shelf. Gila, man. How are you? This, How are you? Yeah, this is from Arab, uh, Dubai. Oh, you're from Dubai? Yeah. So this is 
an airport fire truck. He looks so modern. He looks something out of a sci-fi film. <laughs> they, they used it in Transformers. No. Really? Yeah. This one? This model? Same concept, not ours. Okay. One of our competitors with the same. I see. Bro, it extinguished the airplane, bro. Yeah. Wow. So this is uh, fully manufactured in Dubai from A to Z. It's around 750 horsepower. And it has 10,000 liters of water, 1,300 liters of foam. Mm -hmm. It shoots from the bumper monitor. It oh, shoots. Okay. This one, foam. you can move this up. Okay. You can navigate the bumper monitor and the roof monitor. The uh, monitor, this one? Yeah, it's water. Shooting water, 90 meters. Okay. And 6,000 liters per minute. So in Six. two minutes, water halas. tank and foam tank is empty. Halas. Yes, halas. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Whoa! Yes. This is like every boy's dream, man. We took out in a fire truck, but this is the fire truck that extinguishes uh, the airplane. Yes. Aircraft. In case of emergency at the airport. Yes. They call it ARFF, Airport Rescue Firefighting Truck. Quality, finish, engineering, and very, very easy to use. So if I give you a training for 10 minutes, you can operate it already. Yes. This is how simple it is, bro. Reverse, neutral. And drive? Yeah. This really? Is, this is for the gearbox. Oh, this is uh, for the gearbox? Yeah. Bro, yeah. senang je dia explain tadi. It's yeah. so easy, 10 minit je, dia belajar, kau dah boleh operate this whole thing, bro. Bro, semua benda yang kau boleh tengok kat sini, is all powered here, on the screen. Contohnya ada emergency, this whole button kau boleh tekan ni, it will tell you berapa pressure of air, foam, and then contohnya, kau rasa macam kau nak, uh, nak use this roof monitor kat atas ni, kau press je, pak. Is activated, bro. Kita pun kau nak guna yang depan punya. Kau press je. Dan, can you use both at the same time? Yes. Kalau kau tak nak. You can use both and you can drive at the same time. So you can extinguish the fire while driving. While driving. Yes. Ni deactivate. Ni deactivate. Ni deactivate juga. Yeah. Easy peasy, bro. Yeah, but this is cool. This is only something you see on the aircraft. Yeah. But this is what? Auxiliary this is for the right? top. From the top to control. If you want to shoot. Oh, oh, bro, 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 bro. No, 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 no. Look at I move right. It turns right, bro. It turns left, it turns left, bro. Let's take a selfie. Changi. Gila bro, ini memang uh, memang wonder story ya. How asal dia main drone ya? Asalnya kita buat drone untuk suka suka. Suka suka je. Memang tak ada fikir business. Eh ada lah. Ada boleh boleh suka suka. Ha. Lepas suka suka kita rasa eh, eh ini boleh buat untuk business. Masa tu tahun berapa tu? Itu 2014 2015. 2014 sekarang 2023. Number one in the world. Drone company in the world. Malaysia eh bro, orang Orang Malaysia bro. <laughs> ah. Okay, yo kita tengok one by one lah model-model ah, model dia. Okay. So, kita sebenarnya kita buat empat perkara. Dekat eh, roda ni kita okay. buat agriculture, pertanian lah. Okay. Kita buat pertanian, kita buat surveillance, yes. yeah. critical infra. Kita start ah. dengan critical infra. Critical infra ah, means? Contohnya kalau kat Malaysia ni, kalau aeroda tak buat kerja, tak ada elektrik lah kita kat Malaysia. Kami buat kerja untuk TME. Kita jaga, oh, jaga kabel Jaga kabel dia, respect lah. Kita start dengan Malaysia okay. Untuk buat inspection power line sekarang Satu dunia kita dah buat Okay, interesting sebab apa tadi Cakap macam mana drone ni boleh bantu agriculture Sebab dulu orang macam Macam mana berkena mengenai drone dengan agriculture kan okay. Tapi sebenarnya Apa sumbangan aerodyne agriculture okay. Malaysia okay. Okay. Bayangkan okay. Kita semua binat uh, durian Yes okay. Setahun kami punya customer guna kami punya sistem yeah. Dia punya yield, dia punya increase dia yes. 60% wow. ha, Sebab ambil. apa? Kenapa? Sebab Cuma kita ni? guna precision agriculture Drone kita ni macam specialist Specialist kira nak bagi dia, dia, ubat dia tu dia, dia tengok setiap pokok, pokok ni nak ni Pokok ni nak ni, very special And then uh, bila kita nak apply fertilizer tu ha. Ada cara dia supaya dia efektif Kat lima ni kita showcase Kita panggil project agent tawis hmm. Untuk drone delivery So kalau macam ni, ada tengok automatic cargo delivery. Ha, yang satu, ini, nah, satu hari nanti orang macam order makan pakai ni okay. je. Yang itu kalau order makan kita panggil last mile delivery. Okey. Yang ni kita buat industrial application. Okey. So contohnya uh, 
offshore. Okay. Offshore eh. Nak hantar makanan, nak hantar dokumen, nak hantar spare part. Kalau dulu dia pakai kapal. Sekarang pakai ini kita save 60%. Okay. Double the speed. Kedua kali ganda lebih lagi. Distance dia? Distance boleh pergi sampai 150 km. Ni? Ha, so sampai daripada km. onshore pergi offshore, pergi offshore, tak payah naik heli tak pun payah semua, minyak ni. Bateri? Bateri. Okay, tip satu. Ha. Since kita dah nak move towards uh, something yang lebih jauh lagi kan. Mungkin ada uh, anak-anak muda sekarang ni right. uh, yang into robotics okay. and into uh, drone ni. Mungkin main-main je buat yeah, yeah. macam speed main game yeah. ke. But how can they tap into the same business juga? Ada opportunity apa? Okay. Into engineering ke? Or is it what kind of business yang boleh menggunakan drone ni? So tip eh. Untuk nak buat apa-apa business ni, tip nombor satu kita jangan buat short sendiri. Okay. Kita jangan buat apa yang kita suka. Hmm. Kita kena cari apa masalah di luar. Hmm. Apa yang kita buat ni untuk menyelesaikan masalah hmm. Just, Untuk kita menyelesaikan masalah Kita pun kena cara lah yeah. Kita kena tahu industri tu Antara company yang servis yang hmm. pakai guna Aerodyne uh, Telco company apa? Jadi Malaysia semua ke? Malaysia lah Kami yang pakai, pakai Dekat ya. Australia Telstra I see. Telstra Dia punya lah, the largest uh, Telco company dekat Australia Wow yeah, Guna guna kami Anak Melayu Anak Malaysia bro Number one Impressive Congratulations Thank you. Thank you. you must be proud man I'm proud of my team. Alhamdulillah. Uh, awesome. Okay, dia bukan boy, dia team. Uh, <laughs> 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 Aerodyne. <laughs>